They faced some of the bloodiest fighting in Afghanistan, costing them 14 of their own. But tonight, Royal Marines from 40 Commando are arriving back at Norton Manor Camp Barracks in Taunton. Forces news reporter Toby Sadler joined the families awaiting their return. A short while ago, he sent this report. Well, family and friends have turned out in force today here in Taunton to welcome the men of 40 Commando home. 114 came back today from six months on a very gruelling tour of Sangin. I caught up with one, uh, a Marine, Gavin Taylor, and his wife Julie, and asked him what it was like to be home. Good. Uh, very excited to be home. See, uh, spend a little to bit of time with the uh, children. Uh, certainly be uh, better than uh, 60 odd degrees of heat and a lot of dust. Uh, instead I've got the kids uh, kids' toys and everything to struggle my way through around the house now. Can you sort of sum up the tour for us? Um, long, hot and hard I think is uh, probably the easiest way to explain it. Um, it's been, been a long tour, we've uh, lost a lot of good friends. Um, but uh, hopefully, uh, well, hopefully we've benefited the uh, locals of Sangin. Uh, but, uh, Time will, time will see it, time will tell, and we shall, we shall certainly see. Well, it's relief and joy for many families here, of course. Everybody has in the back of their mind the, the 14 men who aren't returning today, who were killed in, uh, in Sangin. Well, I'm joined by uh, Major Ed Morehouse, uh, who was in charge, really, of uh, Charlie Company. And what's today like with that in your mind? I think it's tinged by two perspectives, as you said. It's, it's hugely euphoric for the lads who are here, and the loved ones have driven a long way to, to enjoy the moment. But it's tinge and a degree of sadness because six of those 14 were members of the Charlie Company and um, they paid the ultimate sacrifice and we will clearly remember them in our thoughts and prayers today and forevermore. I mean how tough a tour was it? It was hard work I mean I think you know the statistics show for themselves but we knew it was going to be hard work Sangin has you know dare I say a slight reputation for for that but the job we've done is good um, and I think we walk away from Sangin a better place we walk away from Sangin handed over to the Americans in good order and they can carry on exactly where we left off. Okay, so, uh, thank you very much. Uh, well, the remainder of uh, 40 Commando will come back throughout the month to the end of October, and then there will be a public parade through Taunton in November so that uh, everyone can uh, offer their congratulations for the tour. Toby Sadler, Forces News, Taunton.